Hi, this is Linda, and, um, well, the USDA starts new program to track farm animals, and this is going to be a mandatory program so that if you get sick from the meat you're eating, they'll be able to track it back to whatever farm, ranch, big agra. Well, let's disclude big agra because it'll never be tracked back to them. The problem is, is it's usually not the ranch or the small farmer's problem. It's the feed that they're being fed, like the corn. Cows don't eat corn. Cows eat grass, and they're not being allowed to eat eat grass like they used to. We're giving them GMO corn, and last year, because of the drought, some cows were even eating candy that had expired. Yes, some farmers were feeding their cows high fructose corn syrup yucky candy that you wouldn't even have given your child. Um, and the cows were eating this. So now they're going to they're going to track these cows and it is a mandatory program so that if you get sick, they're going to blame a farmer. And more than likely, the disease is not going to come from the farm. It's going to come from the feed. So the FDA or the USDA has just took theirself off the hook for what they're putting in feed. Um, chicken feed, for example, has some of it, when you get your baby formula, we're organic here, and some of it has antibiotics and stuff in it. You really have to watch what you buy for scratch. And um, I'm sure that applies to big livestock also. So you really need to know what you're doing, and ours is for our own personal consumption at this point. So um, all I'm saying is now small farms are going to be held responsible and put out of business for the feed, which is Monsanto, ConAgra crap. So they're off the hook, and small farmers and ranchers are now going to be held liable for anyone that gets sick over meat. And so mm, I think that most of you better go to a... A local, a local rancher or, you know, butcher that you know, and, and let's save the small farms and put big agra out of business and stop buying Monsanto crap. Don't feed anything that's Monsanto to yourself, much less to your animals, because if your animals are eating it and you ingest that animal, you're eating the Monsanto GMO genetically modified food crap. So I, I just had to vent on that, being we have organic free-range chickens and one old turkey who is living her life out here. Anyway, peace, guys. Uh, hope things get better. Looks like we're having this. I've been reading the news. This this Boston Marathon's turning out to be another 9-11 um, debacle, I guess you'd say. And I'd say... Uh, they ought to start looking at the people that surround the White House and not at a, us good citizens in the USA. Um, anyway, thanks a bunch. Peace, love, no fear.